here and I'm bringing you a tutorial and today we're going to take a look at sky replacements um, I had a lot of requests to do it so I figured why not so here's what we're going to do today and then with the sky here you know that's basically the effect um, so what we first going to do is we're going to delete these two so we have a, a new comp or basically just create a new comp and wait there we go and then we're gonna be in a, and choose a clip and the clip is really important really um, you have to have one solid uh, sky color uh, it can't be a multicolored sky for this method to work so basically they have to be a only single blue sky or single white sky or whatever color it is but it can't be multicolored because then it w won't work so yeah and I have a CS source counter strike source clip here because I didn't have any other clip on the computer but I thought the sky on this clip was pretty good so you know okay short down here and basically the whole effect we're gonna use is called color key and basically what this is this this removes one of the colors in the, in the movie or in the clip so if you're gonna go into our our effects and preset here and type in uh, color key I already done it so now you're just gonna take this effect and apply it to the clip and click this little pen uh, whatever just click this and you will get this uh, little thingy I don't know what to call it but whatever um, and then just click the color you want to key out and I want to key out this blue sky right here so I'm gonna click and you see the, a little bit of so what we're gonna do is go to color tolerance right there and drag this up until we see some good results maybe like like that but it's not like smooth edges here if you, you see so what we're gonna do then is turn the feather up to blur the edges so it will look a bit more smoother you know and then it's basically done you just have to apply the sky you can like you can create the sky with the star pictures or something but what I like to do is add uh, um, let's see fast moving clouds it's uh, basically just a, a clip I downloaded from YouTube so it's fast moving clouds as the name suggests so yeah here's it it appears up there and, and also what I like to do is oh shit uh, here we go I like to add time remapping to this and put a key from here and then go forward uh, one minute on the clip maybe put a keyframe there and go back here drag this keyframe here so the clouds go even faster and yeah that's basically it I think I'm gonna ram pretty it here so you can see Yeah, that's basically it. This is basically it, and that's the whole effect. So, hope you know. Leave a like or something or a comment if it was something that you didn't understand. And also, I'm gonna link my uh, where you can submit your tutorials if you want to know any effect in the description. Um, and yeah, have a good day. Bye.